Today we're going to go ahead and do an unboxing of TP-Link AV1000 Gigabit Power Line Starter Kit. Now this is an Ethernet adapter that you connect to your power line and it literally just uh, transfer, you know, gives you a sort of Ethernet port access. Let's say if you live in a house um, yeah, or uh, from one room to another, your modem is located in, a, in, in the worst possible area, so you want to be able to connect some Ethernet and you don't have a good way of running cable. So you can use one of these to really get the job done. Well, that's it. Let's just go ahead and open the box. So here we go. Why should I have to? Why can't this just have a pull on tab where I can just pull it and it'll just come right off? All right, so let's go ahead and take a look at the box real quick. So this is the front. You can see some details about it. Um, tells you what it does. So this is pretty much is a plug and play system. You don't need to do anything. You hook it up straight into your router, plug into the nearest outlet, and through the outlet, you'll get your ethernet uh, data connection on another outlet in another room or another floor or so, wherever you want it to go, as long as it's within the same circuit. So it does say that you know uh, you can download the uh, utility uh, from TP-Link website, and that'll help you manage uh, to see whether the two nodes are connected, and a little more information about the package content. So let's go ahead and take a look on this side. So the, the there is power line security in case you're wondering, uh, you know, whether it's safe or not. So I would say 128-bit AES encryption. Yeah, I think you're good to go. You get LEDs, dimensions, range. So you can go up to 300 meters, which is equivalent to your 1,000 feet, over existing electrical wiring. And then you have a nice little diagram in the back that tells you how it works. All right, so let's go to open her up and see what's inside. Right. So inside I have a quick installation guide. You have, the, you have two of them for one end or the other give you a set of, well, two sets of Ethernet cables, and that's kind of it. Let's go ahead and take a look at the guide a little more. Well, that's nice. It's got pictures. You can see how it works. So step one, hook it up to your router. Step two, connect it to the adapter. Step three, you can take that second adapter to wherever you want, as long as it's within the same electrical circuit. Hook it up to your laptop. Or anything else. Now they do have a Wi-Fi version of this. I didn't care so much about it because my Wi-Fi is running from my Google Home. I really wanted to get some, you know, Ethernet connection going from one room to another, and I don't have, I don't feel like running a cable. All right, so here we go. Pretty nice and small. Looks really nice. I kind of like the look of it, the feel of it. it goes straight, uh, connects straight into your outlet. You got one Ethernet port there ventilation and then you have your title information in here i don't know if you can see it but maybe i'll read it to you it's got the mall number it's got the mac address and some form of password i guess if you want to access this unit itself on this side you got information about some of the leds uh, you know whether you have power whether it's connected to your power line and whether you have connected to your network and the way you really want to make it work is now, it should be plug and play. As soon as you put them together, you shouldn't have to worry about doing anything other than just waiting for it to sync. But if it does not sync, you go ahead and press the pair button. And once you push one, you have two minutes to press the other one. So then you can go ahead and, you know, pair them up in your household. They're really nice. I like them. Just to show you how big they are, so you have a better measurement. This is a Pixel 3 charger. Now you can see the size comparison. Pretty nice, huh? I do have to say I'm, I've been using them for a week now. Another set of these and I picked up another pair uh, just so I can hook it up to have more rooms. Um, and I'm happy with the performance. I do like it. Um, do you lose a bit of uh, speed? Yeah, you do because you're running over the power line and depending on if there's a fluctuation on electricity, so if you are having trouble running an Ethernet cable from within your house, one room to another or one floor to another, this is perfect. 
But if you've used this and you have any thoughts or comments that you'd like to share, please let me know. You can easily pick one of these up and enjoy, you know, it's, it's hassle-free, really. Just plug it in one location and take it to another. You could be having, having a modem downstairs and you need to run a line upstairs, but you don't have a way to get up there except drilling through your wall or your ceiling. And if you're like me, you don't want to drill. Um, this is This is good. Good stuff. I like it. I'm happy with it. Definitely recommend it. All right. Now, yeah. if you have any thoughts, feel free to share. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. And that'll be all. Till next time. Peace out.